So we started out looking at, so what's our limit of detection of our assay? How far down can we go? So to do this, we needed a quantified virus source. So we had a number of different things. We had a plasmid, we had, cult, we had virus cultures, we had commercially available standards, and we did this with a number of different things, did a limiting dilution series, and looked at this qualitatively. So is this detected or not detected? And you want to run multiple replicates of this, and the standard for definition for limit of detection is that you have detection of 95% of replicates at that level. So you may detect below the limit of detection, but you'll detect that less than 95% of the time if you run this over and over again. So in our, in our hands, we had a number of, uh, we had actually two different samples here. We had a plasmid and we had an extracted virus. And you could see that if we had copies, our copies down to about 200 copies, we detected it 100% of the time, and then these curves fell off. 